before 1940, the company never even made a profit. In fact, they went into bankruptcy a few times. And this was during the tenure of Roy S. Evans. He was one of the greatest salesmen of all time, and he knew the only hope for Bantam was to sell cars to the government. War had erupted in Europe. The Nazi war machine was moving unchecked across the continent. It was just a matter of time before we were gonna be forced to join the Allied efforts. The U.S. Army was behind the times in regards to modernization. They'd been dragging their feet on the development of a all-purpose scout and tactical vehicle. Bantam had a solution to this problem, and they fought tooth and nail to convince the Army that a small car maker was the right company for this job. 